Welcome to our exploration of how the first Americans arrived in multiple waves from Siberia. The journey of indigenous Americans, shown through ancient mammoth hunts, tells a tale not just of survival, but of significant linguistic and cultural evolution. Recent studies suggest that North America was populated through at least four distinct migratory waves, each adding uniquely to the linguistic landscape we see today. This multifaceted human saga is evidenced through sophisticated linguistic models, archaeological findings, climatic data, and genetic studies. Join us as we delve into the past, unraveling how these early inhabitants shaped the continent and transformed our understanding of North American history. Imagine standing at the crossroads of time, listening to ancient languages whisper tales of human journeys and cultural shifts. This segment explores the groundbreaking research of Johanna Nichols, a historical linguist who used 60 distinct languages to map early North American linguistic patterns. Nichols identified two primary language groups, marking different waves of migration from Siberia. The unique structural features of these languages provide a window into the socio-cultural fabric of their speakers. The first wave, around 24,000 years ago, during peak glaciation, brought a diverse array of languages to the continent. Followed by subsequent waves, they enriched the linguistic scene with features like the NM pronoun usage and varied consonant sounds. Nichols's work, aligning with archaeological and genetic evidence, suggests the presence of humans as early as 35,000 years ago. This recasts our historical timeline and highlights a dynamic, interconnected prehistory far older than previously thought. Our retrospective journey reveals a more intricate American prehistory than once understood. Early migration, possibly beginning around 35,000 years ago, was driven by both the search for new lands and climatic changes that opened new pathways. Johanna Nichols' research confirms that the diverse languages of the US and Canada stem from at least two principal language groups introduced in distinct migratory waves. This linguistic plurality challenges the conventional belief of a single migration across a land bridge 13,000 years ago, instead pointing to earlier migrations entwining new linguistic threads into the continent's cultural mosaic. As we conclude our exploration, data integrates to portray the diverse populations that shaped North America. This evidence portrays numerous cultures and languages, each contributing uniquely to the historical tapestry. Linguistic findings can join with genetic and archaeological evidence to suggest a much earlier human presence, around 35,000 years ago, and a complex development of local languages. Moving forward, these findings prompt further research and promise to deepen our grasp of North American human history. The collaborative efforts of archaeologists, linguists, and geneticists paint a more detailed and vibrant picture of our past. In closing, let us acknowledge the rich legacy of the first Americans and the ongoing research that continues to unveil the complexities of our shared human ancestry. By exploring these ancient paths, we cherish not only the knowledge gained, but also connect deeply with the myriad voices that have shaped this continent over millennia.